Good morning! Or maybe it's evening where you are, and in that case, good evening. In this video, I'll share my 6 a.m. morning routine. Waking up at 6 a.m. is something I've done for years now. There are times when I wake up even earlier, but 6 a.m. is when my day turns out the best because it sets me up so well. If I get up later than that, it's like the train left and I feel like I'm catching up all morning. My first priority is to make sure that Minnie and Bonus, who are now 17 years old, have what they need. I put out fresh food and water for them and take care of the litter box. After that, I get ready to leave to take my walk. I bring the trash with me on my way out. At this time of year, it's still a bit dark outside, but during my walk, the sun goes up. Oh, I should mention that I don't set an alarm to wake up at 6 unless I have an early appointment or I'm traveling. Most days my furry alarms wake me and the other days I just wake up naturally at that time. An hour later when I'm back I hop back into my PJs for a bit and make coffee. Once my coffee is ready, I have a bit of me time. What that means is I'll play for a while on my phone. My friends and I share our daily Wordle results, and I relax with my favorite game, June's Journey, the sponsor of this video. I've shared before that I play June's Journey, and I'm currently on chapter 73, level 366, so clearly I'm hooked. June's Journey is a free to download mobile game. You find hidden objects and declutter rooms and scenes around the world. The goal is to discover the clues that solve the mysterious death of June's sister as well as other family secrets. What I love most about the game is that it's set in the 1920s, which if you know me has always been my favorite era. Also a lot of the games I see around are quite loud and stressful and the music is obnoxious. In June's journey the music is old school, calm and pleasant so it's really relaxing to play. It's also like a game of memory, which is always a good thing to get that brain trained. If you want a fun and relaxing game, you too can download June's Journey for free through the link in the description box below. So, after I've relaxed for a bit, it's time to get ready for the work portion of the day. I get my outfit ready and bring it to the bathroom with me. I hop in the shower, then I get dressed. After that I deal with my hair. When my hair was really short I washed it daily. But now that it's growing out I try to stick to washing it every other day. I can't wait for it to grow to a length where I can put it up again. My hair is very fine Scandinavian hair. It's also very moody. That means that when the weather is humid it gets really curly and frizzy, but when it's cold and dry it goes straight static and clingy. So for me the easiest is when I can put it up, so it's out of my face and stays mostly in place and I don't have to keep fiddling with it during the day. While my hair dries, I brush my teeth. And 
And then I put a little bit of makeup on. As a base I use Clinique ID. That so easily evens out my skin tone. It looks very drab in the bottle, but it adjusts to your skin. I used to wear a bit of foundation, but had to get different shades for summer and winter, which was more of a hassle. This just adapts to however pale or tanned my skin is, and I love that. So quick and easy. I also add a bit of blush. If I'm filming like today, I add a bit of mascara, but on other days I just leave out that step because I can't be bothered. When I'm dressed and ready, I tidy up a little bit to set myself up for a stress-free work day. I hang my walking clothes outside to air dry. That way I can wear them again the next morning. Honestly, after having been aired out, they smell so fresh that you wouldn't know that I got sweaty in them earlier. Then I make my bed, which I already prepared a bit just after I woke up. After getting out of bed, the first thing I do is to fluff my pillows and fold over my duvet so my bed can air out and breathe for a while before making it. I also always crack open the window to let some fresh air in for a while. How long that while is depends on the season. It can be as much as several hours in summer and as little as 5 minutes in winter. I always finish off making the bed with a spritz of room spray. Then I make my way into the kitchen. I fill the dishwasher with the dirty cat bowls and any other dishes that are around. I finish by wiping off the kitchen counter and the table and straighten things out. At this point, around 8am, I'm ready to start my workday. I always have to start by taking down the keyboard and mouse from the shelf above. I often leave my computer on during the night, and Bonus tends to walk all over the desk, so I have to make sure he's not typing emails or editing my videos while I sleep. And that's my current 6am morning routine. Later this winter I'll have somewhere new to walk, as well as probably some new routines, because I'm moving. It's to a building from 1912 in a different part of the city. There will be lots of exciting videos about the move and setting up my new place, so subscribe if you haven't already. 
And if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, it really helps my channel. If you're looking for sources for things, you might get lucky in the description box. And don't forget, if you want a fun and relaxing game, download June's Journey for free through the link in the description box below. Thank you so much for watching, I'll see you in the next one. Hey då!